We're back. It's head to head. Our first edition of head to head for the 2017 college football season. I'm Lauren Sisler. And I'm Kevin Skarbinski, and we're talking Auburn, Georgia Southern. And the big question is, who has the best debut in Jordan-Hare Stadium? Auburn's new quarterback, Auburn's new offensive coordinator, or Auburn's new DJ? DJ Sizzla? Woo -woo. I wish I could get back on the ones and twos, but hey, I'm here at this desk, so let's break this thing down. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> um, I was a DJ. <laughs> Look, Kevin, I don't know about you, but I'm excited for football season to finally start. And I think this is going to be a football game that's going to feature two really good offensive teams. I think that we're going to see a lot of offense from both sides of the football. I'm especially excited, like everybody else and their brother, and you included, to see how Jared Stidham's going to perform. I think he's going to throw the football quite a bit. They are looking for more balance on offense. Excited to see Chip Lindsey and his play calling. So I say Jared Stidham for over 200 yards, but don't expect Cam Petway and Carryon Johnson to take a back seat. I'm looking at 100 plus for both of those guys. Yeah, Auburn's not going full air raid under Chip Lindsey or no. anyone else. Not as long as Gus Malzahn is the head coach. This is a game where Auburn should impose its will fairly early. It shouldn't take four quarters to take charge of this game. Look, they played 25 games against Sun Belt teams in their history, and they're 25 and 0. This is not going to make it 25 and 1. But Georgia Southern is not some school that just started playing football yesterday. In their last seven games against Power 5 teams, four of them have been decided by six points or less. A couple of years ago, they went to Georgia and lost in overtime. So they're a capable team, but they're a young team. They only have eight seniors on their roster. That's the young, makes them the youngest team in the football bowl subdivision. Not a good combination taking that bunch, that bunch of babies into Jordan-Hare Stadium. So the big question is, what is the prediction? How badly is Auburn going to beat Georgia Southern? Kevin, I think it's quite obvious where we're going with this. Auburn is going to run away with this one, quite literally. They're going to run the football as we expect. Jared Stidham, we're going to get a glimpse into what he's capable of. And I think this veteran defense is going to come out, come out and be able to get some penetration in the backfield, stop the triple option, and ultimately take this game to the house. My final score prediction, 45-17, and they'll be ready to go for week two against Clemson. Wait a minute, you know I love trends. Did you know that Georgia Southern has won its last four games in the what? state of Alabama? Four? It's true. Wow. And the streak ends I here. Did not know that. The streak ends here, Auburn 39 to 13.